Okay, everybody, we are out at Bellshire today in Spring Hill, and we're going to just take a little tour inside this gorgeous home that we're about to go check out. Um, it is at 2060 Bellshire Way. I'm going to scan over here. This is the house. It's on home site number 65. It's a Hanover plan. Absolutely beautiful, beautiful house. I just wanted you to see how lovely the landscaping is and all the details on the front of the house, all the attention that's been paid to um, the architectural details on the elevation and the landscaping. This, this neighborhood's really nice because it has a lot of attention to the landscaping and some of the exterior details of the homes. So we're gonna go in. This is the doorway. Got some nice, nice uh, lights out on your front porch, and a lovely door with lights. Well, that's that's builder speak, but that's those are called windows for most people. Windows in your door. Here is what could be your dining room or your study, however you want to to choose to do that. This side of the hallway or the foyer is actually um, probably going to be more like a study because over here you have your light fixture that would be like a dining fixture. Of course, you could choose to do whatever you like, and you've got beautiful windows on either side of the foyer on the front of the house, but lots of um, space to put a hutch or a large table. We've even gotten some eight. Uh, person tables because our dining rooms are huge. We've even gotten eight person tables in there. So you could do that if you'd like. Got lovely hardwood in the foyer here. I don't know if you see all these lovely details, but there are arches and crown molding in both the rooms up front in the house. Lots of nice trim work. Then you come in, and here you have. This archway here goes back to your powder room, which is down this little hall. It's a nice size powder. I'm going to turn the light on. Sorry about that. Here's your powder room. Let's see. And then I'm going to take you back into the kitchen. This is your, is your utility room with tile floors. Nice size utility room with lots of shelving. And then here is your kitchen, which has granite and really nice black appliances. Got granite countertops. I believe those are maple cabinets. Beautiful. Beautiful maple cabinets. And then I'm going to walk right over to uh, the breakfast room. Lots of light in this house. It's really pretty. Nice light fixtures the old iron type of fixtures and then your peninsula out, comes out here in the kitchen along with an island there's the breakfast room and the view out to the backyard nice big backyard patio. And here's your family room. Large size family room with fireplace. Again, you've got lots of details with the arches, arched openings to all of the different rooms, and a really pretty um, old iron type ceiling fan. And you've got like a little niche area to put your, um, if you have TV components or some other piece of furniture that you would like to house your entertainment center or your flat screen. Whole wall of windows across the back of the house. And we're going to walk into the master. And this is the master bedroom, which this video is not going to be able to really show you how large this room is. It's really 
a large master bedroom. You've got three windows in the bedroom, which is really nice. You get a lot of light. You can see out onto the backyard. One of my favorite features is all of the great walk-in closets we have. We have a walk-in closet in pretty much every bedroom in most Jones homes and in this particular one there's a walk-in closet in every bedroom and look at the shelving. It goes on for days. So we got shelving and a large large master closet. I'm going to step out of here. We're going to go to the master bathroom with a large picture window in your master bath over the corner tub which is really nice, a nice jetted tub and then trying to keep me out of the picture I'm going to show you the light fixtures and this is really nice, you've got separate sinks separate his and her sinks and then on your I guess it could be the his side but typically the her side has a little space here that you could, um, a knee space that you could use to put your makeup on here. And then we're going to walk over to, so you can see just how spacious the bathroom is, it's kind of hard to show. Um, you've got tile floors in the bathroom, really pretty neutral tile. And then you have a separate shower, large size shower, separate from your um, garden style tub that's a corner tub. Now, this is going to feel like it takes a few seconds, but we're going to go upstairs and walk back into the family room and see that view from the family room into the breakfast room. And we're going to walk upstairs. Um, this is going to be leading up to our bonus room. It's a really large bonus room in this house. Nice size with lots of windows, lots of light again. Should have turned on the uh, ceiling fan for you. Let's see if we can do that. And then in this house, I really like it too because you've got a lot of extra nice can lighting um, in different spots to kind of help illuminate like the hallway there and your stairs. Again, this is the bonus, but it is huge. I um, don't have the exact measurements on this room, but it is enormous. Then you go from the bonus. You've got an ex you've got another bedroom up here, a secondary bedroom upstairs. Again, two nice size windows for lots of light, and another huge walk-in closet. Really nice. And then you're going to go out of this bedroom, and you see there. There's the half wall leading up to your bonus. So you can kind of see where everything is and give a reference. Get, kind of get a reference to where we are. This is the upstairs bath between the two secondary baths. It's a full size bath and it is good size. It'd be great for if you have two kids or it's also right outside all three of the, top of the upstairs bedrooms so you could use it as a guest bath too. Upstairs, here's another one of your bedrooms. Again, really, really large secondaries. I can't stress that enough. And large secondary closets. Great size closet. I don't know if you can see that, but wow, that's more than just a regular walk-in closet. I have a walk-in closet and that it, this one is twice the size of mine. And it's in a secondary bedroom, which is pretty cool. So we're going to go over to the third bedroom that's upstairs. That means that we have a total of three secondaries on the second floor and your master bedroom is downstairs. So here you go, here's the huge other, here's your another in your third bedroom, you've got another walk-in closet. So all the secondary bedrooms have really spacious walk-in closets, which is nice. So if you've got kids who have a lot of stuff like I do, you can stick their stuff in their closet instead of it all being in their room. So that's our tour of the Hanover at home site number 65 in Belshire.